Hello. Today I'm going to try making a sculpting strategy. Small profit, often. Let's jump straight into it. So a quick word on the setup. I've updated VS Code and I've set my folder to C Drive Freak Trade. I've updated Docker Desktop and WSL. I have no containers or images at the moment. In PowerShell, I updated Python and TA, the technical indicators. So I'm now running Python 3.12.4 and most importantly, reboot. Next, I am going to make a default freak trade setup. So I've got my FT user data. I've got a Docker Compose file. I have a config file and I have a sample strategy. If I fire up Freak Trade, I should be able to go over to a browser. Type in localhost 8080. It appears to be working. Freak Trade on 8080. FQ, FQ. dashboard, it appears to be working. Okay, let's control C and Docker Compose down. So we have our compose file, compose.yaml. Uh, we have to deal with our strategy and we have to deal with our config files. Oh, I also like to make a folder called databases and move our database files into databases. So Docker Compose we can now simply call compose.yaml. Let's open that in VS Code. Version and that can go. All the comments can go. And the databases are now held in the database folder. We are going to create a second bot. I'm going to call it Sculper. Sculper, Sculper, port 81. Sculper log. Sculper databases, a Sculper config, and a strategy called Sculper. So that's our compose file done. Our config file, everything is on the defaults at the moment. The pair list I am going to change to a static pair list so I can back test the API server. I would change to localhost 8080 and I'm going to go over to Binance and grab say 20 pair lists which I will sort by uh, market capital. 
because I don't want to get any new pairs that are popular fly in the night types. Well, if I get the quotation marks, now I have a pair of whitelist. About 25 pairs there. Okay. What name? I'm going to put that at the top. These two can be moved up. Available. Underscore capital one thousand. Let's set that to ten. I think that's it for our config file. Now we're going to find my skeleton strategy and copy that over. So I've copied over my strategy skeleton. I am going to call this Sculper. Let's open it. Name Sculper. The class Sculper. This skeleton strategy simply has stop loss and trailing stop, no indicators, and the action occurs if the volume is greater than zero as simple as it can be. Now I'm going to add a config file called Sculper. And in my Sculper config file, I'm going to have the bot name Sculper. And I'm going to put add config files. Uh, square brackets, I believe. The default config file that we've already put. So anything we put here will overwrite what's in the default config file. So a quick recap. We have our own strategy. We have our own config file. And we have our compose setting up the two bots. Let's correct all the typos and spelling mistakes. Well, that's a pleasant surprise. Looks like it's working. Let's add our second bot on port 81. Still just FQFQ. Mm -hmm. There it is. It's the S. Where did I put that in here? Let's see if that fixes it. So I'm going to stop it. Remove the containers. Start it up again. And let's see if I can log in this time. Yay. So now I've got both of them up and running. Remember, small steps and keep testing. 
So now we have both strategies up and running.